Hello and welcome to Polk County, the heart of Central Florida. I'm Murtis Young, Historic Preservation Manager. Join me as we travel on the Heritage Trail and discover Polk County's rich and diverse historic sites. The diverse history of the area is evident across Polk County, from city centers and urban neighborhoods to rural farms and cultural landscapes along our roads, railways, and rivers. History allows us to explore sense of place, the unique character of the county, and learn about the numerous people and events that shape the region. In celebration of this rich cultural heritage, the Polk County Heritage Trail was developed to highlight more than 150 years of county history. From historic homes and museums to Civil War sites, the trail provides an opportunity for communities to share their local history in the authentic locations where it happened. Join us in exploring the Polk County Heritage Trail. Today's stop on the Heritage Trail brings us to the campus of the Sun and Fun Fly-In, located next door to Lakeland Linder Regional Airport. This sprawling campus is not only home to the wildly popular annual Sun and Fun Fly-In, but also aerospace discovery at the Florida Air Museum and also Central Florida Aerospace Academy. Polk County has a long and rich history in aviation. Airfield construction in the county began in the 1930s and continued during World War II as Central Florida became a popular pilot training area. Lakeland Army Airfield, today's Lakeland Linder Regional Airport, was home to a variety of squadrons during World War II, including B-17s, B-24s, and P-51 Mustang fighter aircraft. The Florida Air Museum, Florida's official aviation museum and education center, chronicles this rich history while also providing a rich array of community educational opportunities. Visitors can explore the museum's aerospace timeline, examine exhibits on military and civilian airlines in Florida, and peruse the interactive Florida Aviation Hall of Fame exhibit. Impressively restored aircraft, including a 1913 Laird baby biplane and RAND's S-19 ultralight to name only a few, line a runway on the museum's floor and are also gracefully suspended above. Visitors can experience the thrill of an air race in a simulator located at the Air Racing and Aerobatics exhibit or explore the Pilot Resource Center for an interactive weather briefing and flight planning. One of the most unique and fascinating additions to the museum is an exhibit on Howard Hughes, American business tycoon, aviator, filmmaker, and aerospace engineer. Hughes was a close associate of Al Lodwig, who ran the Lodwig School of Aviation at Lodwig Field, site of today's Joker Marchant Stadium in Lakeland. Lodwig helped Hughes plan his 1938 trip around the world. The exhibit includes Hughes' personal leather flight suits, rare models of the H1 racer, and spruce goose, racing trophies, books, and other memorabilia. Also located on the campus is the Central Florida Aerospace Academy, one of Polk County School's workforce career academies. This exciting high-tech academy gives students the opportunity to pursue a number of aviation-related careers while earning a high school degree. A massive Boeing 727 is located on the campus, giving students a fully functioning interactive classroom at their fingertips. Polk State College's aerospace program also provides associate and bachelor's degrees in aerospace studies and has a classroom on the campus. Students from both programs have the opportunity to participate in restoration projects at the 8,000 square foot Bueller Restoration Center. The Tom Davis Aerospace Education Center, Piedmont Aerospace Lab, and Crossville Aerospace Center provide additional spaces for year-round STEM educational activities and summer camps. The Sun and Fun Campus provides a wealth of opportunities to explore Polk County's rich aviation history and is only one of many sites you'll find on the Polk County Heritage Trail. So we invite you to hit the trail and see what other interesting sites you'll find in Polk County. 